You're watching Iowa Live. Everything local, entertaining, and meaningful in Central Iowa is right here on Iowa Live. Well, everybody, we have taken the Carl Chevrolet Studios on the road for a very special reason today. The tour of remodeled homes presented by the Remodelers Council of Greater Des Moines is happening this weekend. And Kim Hinkhouse from Design to Build, who is also the tour of remodeled homes chair, is joining us in a gorgeous home. Thank you. Yeah, we're excited uh, to be part of the show again this year and uh, look to have a great show for everybody. Now give everybody an overview of what the tour of remodeled homes are all about because we saw the new homes not too long ago, but these are the improved homes. Correct. So we like to say you've seen the new, now come see the improved. Um, this is a, a show that features 10 homes around the metro uh, area. These homes are all existing homes that have been remodeled in some way, shape, or form. Um, so the new construction is all on one street, which we saw over the last few weeks. These are scattered around the metro area uh, and throughout the western suburbs, even one in Mitchellville this year. And, and the reason they say tour of remodeled homes, because you really can take a tour of these and get some great ideas, can't you? Absolutely. So you buy a ticket and then you are able to go throughout the homes. The show is Saturday and Sunday both, uh, the 5th and the 6th. So your, your ticket gets you into all 10 homes, spend as long as you like. It's a sort of self-guided tour. All of the remodelers are on site at their homes to talk about uh, what they've done and, and the features that they've uh, incorporated into the homes. So this is, do you think this could be done in one day or do you think people should venture out for two days? Kind of depends on, uh, on how detailed you like to be and your pace. Um, most people can can do it in one day um, and plan out the map and, and uh, route your, your tour if you This would be a great a, a group trip. Get a group of people together and just pile in an SUV and, and head on maybe to the east side and work your way across or vice versa. Absolutely. We, got a, we get a lot of kind of husband wives or maybe a, a couple husband and wives uh, that make a day out of it, a Saturday or a Sunday or a group of ladies, a group of men, uh, families of course it's it's friendly for all yeah this home that we are in right now as you can see totally redone uh, we see some of the the before and after pictures and this is not the same house absolutely um, we were excited to sort of to, to sort of totally transform this house um, like no other uh, 80s 90s uh, traditional Des Moines uh, two-story here but um, really the the homeowner had a much more clean modern taste and we were able to bring that in throughout the home whole first floor kitchen master bath um, really f uh, excited to bring in some of the features that really make it more home for them yeah even look at this for I want to look behind me here we first walked in I thought this was a big aquarium no this is uh, the way you go down downstairs, Kim. This is really, really cool. I've never seen this. Absolutely. This is a fun feature piece. Um, before had the traditional oak railing spindles uh, that you see in a lot of, uh, again, t Des Moines uh, homes around that era. Um, this really pops. It shows, uh, it gives that more modern contemporary style and, and really opens things. And gives more depth too. You see right all the way through. Absolutely. Um, also back behind, um, this was a, a typical um, formal living room. We were able to open it up, uh, bring that into more of a lounge, bourbon lounge, um, sort of a more intimate setting back. Yeah, you said it had the, had the arches yep. back, in, yep. back in the day. A very dated uh, look there. So really able to bring that forward. And uh, the client loves that for entertaining and just small groups. So they redid everything up here. How long of a project was it? to get this completed? It was about 12 or 13 weeks okay. um, in total for construction. So we touched tons and tons of surfaces here, um, really pulled everything out and went back in with some really nice finishes. Look at the island. Uh, this is this is amazing. You walked in, we were impressed when we saw the the entrance of the home. We walked in here and our jaws dropped. This What do they call this, this style? Uh, this is a waterfall edge here with, uh, with a quartz. Um, really nice feature piece as you're sitting in the family room uh, looking back uh, the hood is stunning as well um, again sort of a focal point um, you've got the pot filler under yeah look at see the pot filler over there Jeff take a look at the pot filler over the stove for anybody that spends any time in the kitchen that is golden it's a lifesaver for yeah. sure yeah, yeah. 
this uh, this client again they they love to entertain and have both family and friends over so really functional space but uh, just a showpiece in terms of beauty as well okay, and this is one of your projects right correct okay, yep this so is one of your ours. folks will be here this weekend. we will we will be here all weekend long okay let's give everybody the the scoop on what's happening it's Saturday and Sunday starts at 10 o'clock in the morning and goes till 6 p.m. Uh, how do people get tickets uh, they can go online dsmhba.com or you can actually purchase the tickets at any of the shows as, or at any of the homes during the show just walk up you can walk up or get them online ahead of time but this is something else the tour of remodeled homes presented by the remodelers council of greater des moines dsmhba.com we're not done we're going to let you know where these homes are located throughout the metro area when we come back to iowa live